I'm on a better boot he allowed me to film it just under the, the, the part where he presented himself. Maybe they would have uh, taken the camera from me. It might be that, that nobody would have done anything. They would have been so uh, taken aback. <laughs> I took it in 1959, 50 years ago. His uh, reign is now uh, being called uh, the Showa period. And that is nowadays in Japan a uh, period of no nostalgia uh, reaching from the 30s until uh, 1965 or something. The birthday of the emperor, Hirohito, it was the only day that the uh, palace grounds were opened for the public. And I had read it in the paper, so I went along too with uh, my, uh, my camera. And uh, yeah, we started to film. And I could get, well, not near the emperor, but at any rate, I got a view of him and I could make a movie of it. But I heard that in Japan, photographs being published of the emperor are not so uh, uh, applauded because they actually think that you shouldn't photograph the emperor. Uh, Japanese were not even allowed to, to watch, to, to look at the emperor when he passed in the streets before the war. People all uh, had to uh, stand with their backs towards the emperor. So uh, the, my taking photographs of this emperor, yeah, that was kind of an insult. And they hesitated at the photo exhibitions, even now, whether they should in, uh, accept that photograph.